Tea Time with Trav. A.O. Sauce is on sale right now. Monica Lewinsky has that title for the rest of her life that she gave a little something, something in the Oval Office. Apparently, if she did, Bill Clinton had to have done the same thing. So why isn't he being scrutinized for it? What's going on, y'all? It's L. Trevor, and I'm back, 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 back. I'm back again. I'm going to hiccup, y'all. <laughs> um, before I do anything, let me tell y'all. A.O. Sauce is on sale right now. Go get it. <laughs> um, what do I have? I have soul food, y'all. Um, barbecue ribs. I have dressing with gravy. I got mixed veggies, mac and cheese, of course, collards. And I got this mother pork chop. So I'm going to go ahead and take Grace. And we're going to jump into this business. Finally, God, I come to you today to ask you to watch over this food. Please, that be a nourishment to my body. Please, I'm not just this food properly. And you're in my prayer. Amen. Amen. One more time. Amen. How was y'all day going today? How was y'all day going today? Ooh, how was y'all day going today? Ooh. He's some big ribs today. Y'all see that? Ooh. Right. These ribs are nice and tender. I don't know, I'm trying to get all my meat out. So I'm digging through the fat and the bones. What are y'all doing? Let me go for this one. Ah, what did I do today? I went to the gym, of course, and I did some errands to start preparing for my trip for my birthday. For y'all that don't know. My birthday is on May 13th. Mm. There y'all. That is so real. Gristle bone on. But anyway. I told y'all before I'll be out of town for my birthday. I'm excited. This is my first real trip since um, COVID. So, that is exciting. Y'all already know, vaccinated or not, I'm gonna be masked up. There'll be a lot of people out there. I ain't got the time, y'all. I ain't got the time. I just love these little things. This one is um, kiwi strawberry. I wish they, they need to sell those in two liters. They had a bomb diggity dot bomb diggity dot we're bomb diggity dot com. That's what it is. I don't know what I was saying, y'all. <laughs> These greens never let me down.
Should ask for extra gravy just so that it'll dry. Oh my god. That's good. I was scared, y'all. I don't like to eat everybody's dressing. Because my godmother makes the best dressing in the world to me. I'm not gonna eat them veggies. I'm not gonna spit it out. I'm not gonna eat them. Mm. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Oh. Why would it fall like that? I know I was doing the most. So we their gravy is really good. Y'all back to the entire conversation. And I'm going to warn y'all right now. Fellas, you probably not going to like this conversation. Women, you might like it. Mm. I'm about to go get my other one, y'all. One second. Okay, y'all. I'm back. Oh, show. Oh, oh, oh. Did it get on my food? <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Oh, sorry, y'all. <laughs> I was dancing while I was walking back, so I guess I shook it up. That was dumb. <sighs> okay. Back to my meal. <laughs> I hope it didn't get in my rice. That'll be real nasty. Let's see. If it tastes like mango or orange, I don't know what I got in here. I'm going to eat it anyway. I didn't get enough. We good. We good. So, tea time with Trav. Mm. I'm going to start it off with a question. Why don't male celebrities get held to the same standard as women? I'm gonna tell you what I mean by that. Women can do the smallest thing and it's stuck with them for the rest of the life, but when a male do it, they let it go. For instance, I'm, I'm gonna start with, ooh, I'm, ooh, it's a list. Let let me start with Brandy. Anybody who's a fan of Brandy or you know whatever, y'all know that she went um kind of took a break in a way because people started to look at Brandy sideways when she apparently lied about being married, and then. She got into a car accident, which she was not charged for. And I believe somebody lost their life. 
But it's like people will never let her live those two things down. And it kind of, in a way, altered the direct uh, the direction that her career was going in. But then you have male celebrities who write songs about harming people, and it's okay. She accidentally harmed somebody, and y'all won't forget about it. They intentionally do it, and y'all love them for it. They real. They thugs. It makes no sense. Another example. Monica Lewinsky and Bill Clinton. Monica Lewinsky has that title for the rest of her life that she gave a little something, something in the Oval Office. Apparently, if she did, Bill Clinton had to have done the same thing that she did. So why isn't he being scrutinized for it? You know, they call him the man. They all, Whenever they make a joke, they make a joke about Monica Lewinsky, not Bill Clinton and Monica Lewinsky or not Bill Clinton by himself. It's only Monica Lewinsky by herself as if it did not take two to tango. Boom, we're not done there. Let's keep going. Women celebrities on these reality shows, they fight all the time, not gonna lie. And they're they're called ghetto, they're ratchet, they're classless, they're this, they're that. But people like the baby love his music. We didn't see him on camera knocking a few people out. And people applaud him for it. They they laugh. No, he knocked him out. It's like he get a hand clap. But if a woman does that, I'll use Portia Williams, for example. Portia had a plethora of fights on love. I'm not going to say a plethora. That's, that's over exaggerated. Portia had a couple fights on Housewives. And they just made it seem like she was just this angry person. And she needs anger management and this and but then y'all applaud a man for doing it. I just don't get that. I don't get that. Well, boom, we're not done. Let's keep going. Because we got a list today. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Getting another drink of it now. If, if it decides they want to shoot out again, I'm gonna just throw it across the room. I don't care. This one is orange mango, y'all. I'm for real. I love these things. Like I'm obsessed. Mm-mm. I'm -mm. down my mouth. Excuse me. Cool. Now. Let's talk about it. P. Diddy and Pebbles. I respect P. Diddy to um, to hell and back. But a lot of P. Diddy artists talk about how he doesn't pay them or he did, did, did you know, treat them horribly. But nobody's canceled P. Diddy. TLC make a movie and they talk about what happened with Pebbles, how she was taking their money and everybody want to make all these jokes about Pebbles and cancel Pebbles. Why are they making all that noise? You know, and I just think, it's just like, mm. Why is it okay for one to do it and not the other? I've always been told it's a man's world. And I see it more, the older I get. As if it ain't been right in my face my whole life. But, you know, with age come wisdom. So of stuff you look back on, you be like, dang. Dang. <laughs> Dang. 
Boom. We're not done. Next up on the menu, we have Dr. Dre. Mm. Mm. If I'm not mistaken, several women, oh, that's all my teeth. Several women filed complaints about Dr. Dre beating them or putting his hands on them in some capacity. Dr. Dre has never been canceled. Never. I was going to say Tiger Woods, but he. He not worth my breath. But he did what they suspected he did. I don't care what nobody said. He, I, I said Tiger Woods. I meant OJ Simpson, y'all. <laughs> Forgive me. Why would I say Tiger Woods? I'm talking about OJ. That was dumb. Excuse me. Excuse me. Maybe the heat, um, the heat from <laughs> outside, y'all. It's 80 something degrees outside, and then I was working out, and it, it's the heat. It is the heat. <clears throat> Ooh, excuse me. Excuse me. But we are not done. There's more. I told you I have a list. Next up on the list, we have Dr. Luke and Kesha. Kesha was making a name for herself in the early 2010s. She was coming up in the pop world, y'all. And then she accused Dr. Luke, who's a professor, professor what is wrong with me who's a producer she accused dr luke of sexual harassment needless to say kesha no longer makes music mm, that was a bone Kesha no longer makes music, but I believe Dr. Luke does. How was the victim blackballed? But the victimizer was not. That snap is for all my ladies out there. <laughs> Once again, I'm sorry, fellas, if y'all get mad, but I, somebody had said because ain't nobody's in it. And everybody want to yell. Protect women. Until it's their favorite role model. Who's the one that's hurting these women? I saw yesterday. Um, Kodak Black. That's his name. He pleaded guilty to. But I, I don't know the exact charge, but apparently a girl didn't want to sleep with him. So he bit her and then like beat her up. And he pleaded guilty to that. Now, after the fact, he said that he pleaded guilty because they've been battling this case for five years. Excuse me. And him and the victim just wanted to be over with. But he... You know, he's not admitting to do anything. But my thing is, how did he get to court in the first place? Hmm. But anybody canceling him? Ooh, this burn. 
and about to cancel him. And what, what, ooh, what, uh, ooh. Hold on, let me drink this drink real quick. Cause I gotta say this, cause this, it pisses me off. <clears throat> Excuse me. The main ones that I see supporting these women abusers are women. How are you pro woman, defend women, protect women, but you're here protecting the people who are hurting women? Make that make sense. It really pisses me off. That joke, see, I just got tight. That really pisses me off. When I see that, like when I go on these blogs and I read the comments, it be women. He's innocent. Free him. She's lying. Da 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 da. -da. What? That's why they'll keep getting away with doing stuff that they're doing. Because the people that they're doing it to won't stick together to put an end to it. It don't make sense to me. I'm sure I can make it make sense, please. But I'm clear. Because it don't. It ain't just me, it don't make sense at all. I know sometimes I don't see everything clear, but. No. Mm mm. I was about to go to sign down. I'm a little fool. So, if you haven't not subscribed, to, wait. What am I missing? I'm missing something for it. Boom! Ayo sauce is on sale right now. Make sure you go get it before it's sold out. You can jump into the description box. You're gonna see the website www.aotribe.com. Then get the Ayo sauce, the Ayo merch, all that. Y'all already know if you're not subscribed to the channel, right there. Boom! And right there. Boom! So you can notify me every time I drop a video. But if you want to stay connected with the Ayo Tribe, just Jump back to the description box, go down the bottom, brr, boom, right there on the day, social media, Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, and follow me, leave me a comment, Instagram, leave me a comment, Instagram, leave me a comment, do whatever, let me know what you like, what you don't like, what you want to see, what you don't want to see, what you want to see, what you don't 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 want to see, what you don't